What's up guys, Digigabuli Architect here and welcome to my channel. Our topic for today is about Revit on how to create a room. Okay, first, let's go to Architecture tab and then sa Architecture tab, makikita mo dito yung room. I-click natin yan, tapos i-select natin yung room, yan, nag-create siya ng room. Ito yan. Tapos yung room, pwede mo lang yung i-edit yung room name let's say that one is office that one office pag gusto mo makita yung area ng room dito by selecting this one and then go to edit type then select this one show area check this one apply okay so di ba dito sa room name natin may lumalabas na area so pag gusto mo rin yung ayaw mong makita yung area select, select this one edit type tapos uncheck yung show area apply okay okay next is yung room separator di ba ito yung room separator so delete mo natin to yan tapos paano ba gagawin yung room separator by selecting this one tapos dito gagawa ka ng room separator so di ba meaning ang ibig sabihin ng ganyan pag gagawa tayo ng room yan Di ba, linaka-separate na yung isang room but dalawang pangalan lang room. Ito yan. Tapos, okay mo lang. Yan. Plus natin yan. Sorry. Dali, dali, dali. Tapos, next is yung tinatawag natin na room bounding. Ano bang ibig sabihin ng room bounding? Di ba, li? It, mayroon tayong room ay, uh, world separator ito but gusto natin yung itong buong ito is isa lang yung area ang kukunin natin so by selecting this one select that one tapos dito makikita yung room bounding uncheck mo lang yan tapos go to architecture tab select this room yan so di bali kinukuha lang yung area yung ano natin yan i-check mo natin yung show area apply okay so di bali itong room na to kinuha na yung buong area ng di bali yung may separate na wall ito so yung tinatawag din natin na room bounding next is yung tag room ano ba yung tag room yung yung tag room is ito yung mga di bali maglalagay tayo ng room names yung area ma-identify natin so Let's go to architecture tab Tag room, select this one This one Or just type RT, show it for tag room Select this one Then Point here Then In each room Yeah And then As usual Select this room Then let's add The area Let's show the area Ayan Tapos ito Let's say open work area tapos ito is yung office one tapos ito let's say office two yan so di bali dito din sa section ito section ito pag maglagay na tayo ng room tag dito let's go to architecture tag room select this one tapos pag ilagay natin dyan yan automatic kung anong dito na, na nilagay natin na open work area automatic din nagki-create dito ng room name tag pati rin dito select natin yan yan di bali ito na yan office 1 automatic dito din na mayroon tayong office 1 so ganun na guys yung creating a room so new reasons to learn guys so don't forget to like share and subscribe 